Insectivores. We're curious. Do you journal? If so, what are the techniques that you use? If you love journaling or you're just starting to explore the practice, there are plenty of techniques that can make your experience even more rewarding and that are all about helping you understand yourself better, process your emotions and experiences, and grow as a person. So let's take a look at some of the most effective journaling techniques out there and how they can benefit you. Stream of consciousness journaling. When your thoughts are flowing, what do you do about them? Stream of consciousness journaling is a great technique that allows you to simply let your thoughts flow onto the page without any editing or filtering. The idea is to write down whatever comes to mind no matter how random or jumbled it may seem. This technique can be really beneficial if you're looking to clear your mind, process your emotions, and gain a deeper understanding of your thought patterns. It's a great way to practice self-reflection and get to know yourself better. University of Texas at Austin, researcher Dr. James Pennebaker found that individuals who wrote about their emotional experiences for just 20 minutes a day for four consecutive days experienced improved immune system functioning and reduced symptoms of stress and anxiety. To try this technique yourself, just set a timer for at least 20 minutes, find a peaceful spot, and let your thoughts and feelings flow freely onto the page. No editing or judgment necessary. Gratitude journaling. How grateful are you? even with small things. According to renowned psychologist and leading authority on gratitude, Dr. Robert Emmons, expressing gratitude can have a profound impact on your physical and mental health. His research has found that it can strengthen your immune system, lower your blood pressure, improve your sleep quality, and even reduce symptoms of depression and anxiety. Plus, by expressing gratitude towards others, you can cultivate deeper social connections and promote feelings of empathy and closeness. Gratitude journaling not only makes you feel good, but can also attract positivity and abundance into your life by intentionally focusing on the good things present. Try jotting down a few things you're grateful for each day and see the difference. Let us know how it makes you feel in the comments below. Future self journaling. Do you often imagine what you will look like in the future? University of Missouri psychology professor, Dr. Laura King, has found that when you imagine your ideal future self and write about what that version of yourself would do, feel, think in different situations, you'd often experience an increased sense of purpose and meaning in life. This can lead to a range of positive outcomes, such as feeling happier and more optimistic about the future. Through future self-journaling, you can clarify your goals and align your current actions with your desired outcomes, giving you a greater sense of control over your life. To practice future self-journaling, Imagine your ideal self, including the person you want to be, what you want to achieve, and how you want to feel. Then write in detail about your future self, including how you would act, think, and feel in different situations. For example, if you want to be a successful business owner, you could write about how you would approach challenges, interact with clients, and manage your time. This practice can help you identify the steps needed to achieve your goals, keep you motivated and focused, and ultimately lead to a more fulfilling life. Intention setting journaling. Did you know that writing down your intentions can help you track your goals? According to psychology professor at Dominion University of California, Dr. Gail Matthews, participants who wrote down their goals and shared their progress with a friend achieved their goals at a higher rate than those who didn't write them down. By writing down your intentions and action steps, you can break down your goals into smaller, manageable tasks and keep yourself accountable by tracking your progress over time. It's a simple practice but it can make a big difference in helping you achieve what you set out to do. Intention setting journaling helps you stay motivated and focused on your goals. By writing down your intentions and specific steps to achieve them, you can track your progress and hold yourself accountable. You may also feel more confident and fulfilled as you work towards your goals. Self-reflection journaling. How do you reflect on your experiences and emotions? In a study by psychologist and mindfulness expert, Dr. Karen Bluth and her colleagues at the University of North Carolina, they found that mindfulness-based interventions, which included self-reflection journaling, were effective in helping adolescents manage their mental health. By taking the time to reflect on their experiences, participants were able to gain a deeper understanding of their thoughts and emotions, which helped them develop a greater sense of self-awareness and emotional regulation. So if you're feeling overwhelmed, it might be worth taking some time to reflect and write about your experiences. Self-reflection journaling is a helpful practice where you reflect on your experiences and emotions, learn from them, and gain insights into your behavior and thoughts. It can impact your emotional and psychological well-being by developing self-awareness, compassion, and understanding of your thoughts and behaviors. Dream journaling. 
Did you know that dreams can be a reflection of your subconscious? According to Dr. Ruben Nyman, clinical assistant professor of medicine at the University of Arizona Center for Integrative Medicine, keeping a dream journal can help you make sense of your dreams and gain a deeper understanding of yourself. Dr. Nyman recommends viewing your dream journal regularly to identify patterns and themes that may be present. By doing so, you can explore the inner workings of your mind and even gain insight into your psyche. By writing down your dreams as soon as you wake up, you can gain insights into your subconscious thoughts and emotions and even find unique solutions to everyday problems. Plus, dream journaling can be an emotional release valve that helps you process and express difficult feelings that you may have trouble dealing with in your waking life. And the best part is that dreams can provide a wealth of imaginative material. So exploring your themes and images can be an excellent way to tap into your creativity and find new sources of inspiration. Do you have a dream journal? Share your experiences in the comments below. We'd love to hear from you about the journaling techniques we've shared. Do you find them helpful? Do you have any other techniques that you'd like to share with us? Let us know in the comments below. We're always looking for new ideas. And if you found this video helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends who might also benefit from it. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you again next time. And remember, you matter.